Well, now, obviously, Thanksgiving is not going to be the usual drill this year, and that is disappointing for many people. It's expected close to 50 million people will be traveling for the holiday next week, 95% of them on the roads. Airline travel is still drastically down from the same time a year ago. And if you live in New York, quarantine restrictions remain in effect for pretty much every state in the nation. In many cases, on both ends of your trip, if you go somewhere. So how do you break the news? news to your out-of-town family that there's going to be no get-together this year. Here's 7 Eyewitness News reporter Olivia Proya. Spread thanks, not COVID. That's Governor Andrew Cuomo's Thanksgiving message. I have a conversation with my mother. Several conversations about Thanksgiving. We have to get together for Thanksgiving. Uh, Mom, we can't get to give, together for Thanksgiving. Governor Andrew Cuomo predicts Thanksgiving gatherings will fuel a massive spike in COVID cases if celebrated normally. Well, when you really look at the pros and cons, is there really anything that's worth risking someone's life over or carrying the guilt of knowing that you may have harmed somebody? and been responsible for their death. So how do you tell grandma, grandpa, or other loved ones that Thanksgiving can't happen like it normally does this year? I would say, grandma, I know you would risk it all, but long after you're gone, I will have to carry on the burden that if you passed away, I will have to live with it. So this is a selfish decision. Because of your decision, somebody ended up on a ventilator and may not get off. And then think about it even further that that person who's on the ventilator in the hospital is alone. There's no family coming in. Experts say in the end, saying no can be a gesture of love. Please understand this is about my love for you. It's not about my not being able to see you. It's an act of love out of you. And even though your act of love would be sacrifice, my act of love would be, you know, not sacrificing you. Grandma, I kind of want to see you next year. And I kind of want to see you the next year after that. Like, and to be honest with you, if I do this, I'm afraid I won't get to see you because you bring such joy to me. Olivia Proya, 7 Eyewitness News.